Today is Barge Day. I am dedicating this entire... Ow! This entire episode to the barge. And the first thing that I'm going to do is give you some kind of idea of how long I have been chopping wood. Not the most exciting thing, but two hours of chopping wood and I have a feeble amount. Yeah, check check this out. Really quick time lapse. Not e not even gonna not even gonna give you any music. It's that's how unimportant and boring this was. Chopping wood. But check it out. I've got. I didn't even get a full shulker box of some of the bits. Like two hours, and I, you know, I kind of regret getting into the log business. To be honest with you, I don't have an auto log producer or the the whatever they what are they called? Wood farms. <laughs> I don't have a wood farm. But I have got enough stock. To go ahead and yeah there's a raid in my base and I can't find it I don't know where it is I've I don't know how it happened I don't know where they are I've had a look around nothing oh oh found found you that is more than what are they all there I think that I think this is the most bizarre raid I've ever seen I think there is! They're all there! <laughs> they're having a party! Oh, they're having a rooftop party! That's amazing! That is amazing! Well, I wasn't expecting that. Right, well, raids take a long time to fight, so we're gonna forget about that. We're gonna go and stock up the barge. But like I was saying, I uh, regret getting into the log business. Let's stock all of this up. Believe it or not, logs are one of my biggest sellers. Okay, so stocked up the barge with logs, but we're not actually going to be focusing on this barge. We're going to be making something that you might have seen on my community post. Oh my goodness, there's someone behind me. And I also have a proximity chat on, so we might be able to hear Scar. You do have proximity oh chat Oh my on. goodness! No, that scared me. <laughs> you, you waited. I was like Batman <laughs> up in the rafters of Aquatown. You waited just long enough for me to question whether proximity chat was working. So Scar and I aren't actually using Discord right now. We're just using a Minecraft mod. And the further I get away, a tech, I think, right? The, the I, quieter yeah, yeah, you get. Quieter, quieter. There you go, quieter. Hello, Scar. Can you hear me? Hello, hello, hello. Amazing. Hello. Um, uh, and I, I just, can you explain what's going on with your face? Um, I, no, I can't explain it other than that it's beautiful. Yeah, you know what? I don't even want to know. While you're here, actually, can I, are you still selling this tower? Because I would, uh, I'd still love it. Oh, the big one. Yeah, you, yeah, you yeah, put yeah. signs and I tore them all down. Um, So I forgot. You, you How much did you want to buy it for? I don't remember. How much did you buy it for? Oh, you know, 200 diamond blocks. I don't believe that for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I don't actually remember. Go on then. How much do you want? Um. Okay. All right. It's not about the diamonds. It's about something else. Come okay. with me. Come with me. Up here, up on threads, that there is a ginormous, and I mean ginormous oh. B-Dub's face up there. It's beautiful. It's what? Uh, no, it's disgusting oh uh, all right right so the stipulation with buying this property would yep. be that that needs to be changed out or removed entirely bonus points if it's of me and jelly but not a requirement on that front but it needs to be removed and i'll sell it for 35 um, blocks 35 you drive a hard... you're mr Moneybags. <laughs> this building will be great for your entrepreneurness I don't think that's a word, but just think just think of the prestige the barge industries will have by owning the best building in Aquatown. Done. <gasps> Done. And, and, and the billboard. Uh, I kind of like the billboard. <sighs> if I give you five diamond blocks back, will you will you remove it? Yes, I will. Sold. I am I am the greatest negotiator. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's now my tower. Mm-hmm. But all I have to do is remove the billboard. Remove the billboard, and it is 100% sealed in yours. Okay. Done. Shake on it. How do we shake? Ow. Oh, jeez. <laughs> no, I'm going to hold it. I lost all my hearts. <laughs> the proximity okay. mod just made that so much better. <laughs> Look, watch this, watch this. Uh... Oh, that is actually great. <laughs> oh wow! <laughs> you do, you do it, you do it, you do it. 
Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay you do it, you do it. Korea! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's awesome. <laughs> oh, man. Oh! <laughs> Can't even talk to Scar now because he's nowhere near me. Oh my! <laughs> this is how you do business in Aquatown. <laughs> Hello, I'm back. Oh, oh man! I got your stuff. I. I've never had to do that before. I literally just I just had to wait about five minutes before doing this next clip because my cat was purring too loudly into the microphone. I just I just had to ask her for politely. Can, can can you stop purring? Okay, so now what we're going to do is work on Barge HQ. Now a while ago, I put a poll on the community post on YouTube asking which one did you prefer, A or B. And I've got to say, it's probably about, it's, it was a close call. Yeah, 99% of you said B. 99%, that's such a huge amount. And also, 120,000 comments, maybe even more by now. Crazy. These posts are mad. Okay, so I am actually going to agree with you. That's the one that I want to build, B. I want this to be very open, airy, and glassy, and here is Scar. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get into a time lapse of building an enormous barge HQ, and I think I might actually make it a little bit taller than my original design. One, it can kind of match what's here, and two, looks like there's plans to build something on this corner plot, so I want it to stick over the top. So I might need to make this quite a bit taller than I initially thought, but that, okay, that's okay. There's there's no one enforcing vertical height restrictions, is there? Desk of the building officer of vertical enforcement. Hmm. Well, that's just inviting something to happen, isn't it? So what? How does this work? Welcome to the office of the building of vertical enforcement, Bub. Why didn't they make it Aqua? A Aqua Office of Building, no wait, Aqua Building Officer Vertical Enforcement, above. You've missed such a trick there. Okay, uh, what is the building limit? What is the building limit? Impulse, this is the worst document I've ever seen. It says, it says that there's a maximum height limit, but you haven't said what it is, and I can buy more. That's just, that's asking for trouble. I've had a look at his video, and it turns out the answer is 90 blocks. 90 blocks is the limit for... Aquitown, apparently, and you have to buy more. Well, forget that. It's not happening. So why don't we just go out of our way to be really annoying and make a build that's 91 blocks tall. Hmm? Or maybe even taller. I don't know. Right, anyway, let's get into this time lapse and make ourselves a big old Tower of Barge. Let's go. Sorry, Green. Check it out. We have one completed Barge HQ tower. Let's get a bit of a better angle on this because, well, it's probably not a huge shock. It's uh, probably in the thumbnail and I already asked you which design I wanted, but does it remind you of any particular building? If you said Big Ben, you're wrong because Big Ben is the bell, but it does resemble Elizabeth Tower in London and that is very much the inspiration for this particular build and do you know what I think it actually fits inside of Aquatown very very nicely now I've been thinking about this guy here the big smiling b-dubs and I think that it's kind of a shame to get rid of it but it is part of the deal of collecting the deed for this tower. So I'm just gonna clarify something really quick with Scar. Scar, can you confirm that all I have to do is not have B-dubs on the billboard? I just need, I don't know whether he wants me to remove the entire billboard or if I can just remove the B-dubs. Yes. Fool. Okay, so I have a few ideas and we're gonna have to experiment to see what works. 
First of all, let's take a screenshot so we remember exactly what this looks like. I want to know if B Dubs's face will fit inside the Barge HQ. Oh, well, that's mighty cursed. That is so cursed. B Dubs with no eyes. <laughs> uh, they say the eyes are the windows to the soul, but it would appear that B Dubs's eyes are the window to a rather empty building. Okay, let's go and have a look and see if this will fit. So I've got all the bits of B Dubs's eyes, which I never thought I'd say in an episode of Hermitcraft. It's going to be a bit of a weird one today, isn't it? You know, talking about B Dubs's eyes. I can immediately say I don't think this is going to work because that's that's his eyes. And I can't do much more than that in this small space. <laughs> looks like, yeah, it looks like uh, we got a very happy Barge HQ and a very soulless B-dubs. No, no, I don't think that's going to work for me, unfortunately. So, I... And also, I don't really want to actually remove the billboard. So, according to Scar, all I need to do is remove B-dubs from this. So, I have a feeling that there's... I think there's a workaround here. So, what I'm thinking is just to save myself having to fill in... Because this billboard isn't actually on top of the building. It is the building. If I remove the billboard, I'd have to make an entire side of the building. But I think it would be much better... If we just refilled and changed up some of the colours and the palette of this build. And I think you might be guessing where it's going as I change this blue to red. If you haven't figured it out yet, I guess you know where it's going. Boom. Exactly what Scar didn't want. Okay, so we've replaced B-dubs with a giant smiling green, which I've got to say doesn't quite deliver the smile that B-dubs this skin does. It, it, it is a feeble imitation if you ask me. However, it's still, it's still pretty cool. What we are going to do is we're not going to actually say goodbye to B-dubs this skin because I would like to include it on the barge. I specifically asked if it was just about removing B-dubs from the billboard. Scar never said I couldn't put it anywhere else. So, the plan here is to create a bit of a flying B-dubs hanging from barge HQ. I don't care if it's got nothing to do with the barge, I just really like seeing B-dubs's smile into my soul face. And take a look at that. B-dubs is back. Just hanging around. I think this works pretty well. You can see B-dubs just, just peeking over the top of all of the buildings. I don't think it detracts too much from Barge HQ, especially if you look at it from this angle, which is, I'll be honest, this is the open area at the moment, so this is kind of where everyone's hanging out. So it doesn't interrupt the skyline, and then as you're just walking through the town, B-dubs. I don't, I can't let that big smiley boy down. So that's my project for Aquatown complete, but what's going to go on the inside? Well, up here, I hope to make my Barge HQ office. Now I've been putting a great deal of thought on how to get up and down this rather large tower. And I've been doing some explosive testing on my server to see if it's possible. And I believe that, oh my goodness, no wonder I ran out of materials. I forgot to <laughs> I forgot to take down the eyeballs. <laughs> Whoops. Um, that that explains a lot. I was like, what? where is where have all these bits of wool gone? So what I'm thinking is we have a, basically a TNT dispensing square right in the middle. You turn it on. You stand here. As long as you're on full health, it'll launch you all the way up, hopefully to the top. Uh, hopefully. Maybe just that layer and then you've got to walk the rest of the way. And then up here, we want our actual meeting room. And we get a lovely view of B-dubs' face. So this is going to be perfect. But what is Barge HQ actually going to do? Well, it's not just a place for my office. What this is actually going to be is one last money-making venture for the Barge. So the Barge has been great. It has made me a very wealthy person on the Hermitcraft server. It ba basically, it sells just about everything that you would need, but it particularly focuses on grindy things such as hello, sand, and gravel is my biggest money maker. 
but it also includes a bunch of other stuff in now including logs which I seriously regret getting into and a bunch of other stuff that's a pain in the neck to get your hands on and we've tried our best to venture out into different things we started selling boxes of stuff which haven't actually sold too much, but we also tried things like Barge Quest, which were extremely successful. So, my next venture is going to be some sort of mini game, but it's, uh, I don't think it's been done on the Hermitcraft server before, so I'm not actually going to spoil it, because it's going to take me a little while to make, and by a little while, I mean a very long while. This is not, not something that I need to get into lightly, and it's certainly going to prevent me from making the back of the mansion for at least another couple of weeks, so that's why we're definitely going to do it. Okay, so, what we're going to have is our launcher up to the top, and the start of a barge related mini game which i think will prove to be reasonably popular we've had a bit of a disaster here i'll i'll be honest with you i i, I got really angry cuz <laughs> i've set up this and uh, I wasn't recording. I'm, I'm not annoyed that it blew up. I'm actually annoyed that I wasn't recording because I was <laughs> I was just I was just like idly doing this and I I clicked the button it released the TNT if you don't know this is a launcher So basically you stand on here it launches TNT and up you go. That's at least that's the plan and <laughs> I watched as one TNT just slowly slid into the bubble elevator and it just went Bang! Everything, everything went. Lost all the glass, and what was really annoying, I lost about half my shulker boxes. I don't think it was anything too much. But anyway, enough of my uh, woes. What I need to do is give this a proper test. So we got a splash potion of Turtle Master to give me the proper resistance. There should be some TNT in there. And uh, let's just see if this works. Oh no, not again, not again, not again! Oof! Okay. I don't think this works. That's that's not far off what happened last time. <laughs> that's not far off what happened last time. Okay, so I'm thinking the bubble elevator isn't the way to go. So when I say that this was tested on my server, I mean it definitely worked on my server, but I didn't quite anticipate that I'd have to edit the design a little bit. Uh, so this this has not gone particularly well Let's just do a botch job for now. Okay, should we try this again this time? I'm going to use my I thought I was gonna be clever by using soul sand to kind of propel me so uh, forget it this time I'm gonna put a slab there and In theory all I got to do Is just bounce on it like this That I don't think this works, does it? I feel a bit silly as well, sitting in the pool of failure. There must... I'm pretty sure this worked. Whoa! Well, at least this time it doesn't self-destruct. Let's try again, because I think I had it. Let's go. Three, two, one. No. It, it, it launched me, but not far enough. So let's try adding two more. Okay. We're going to test this. Test number two. And go! Alright. Doesn't launch you straight up. Which is a bit annoying. Right. Last chance. Ah. They don't all... They need to explode at the same time. Okay. Come on. Oh no! Oh no! I ran out of potions! Guys, I think I've lost all my items. I think I've lost all my netherite gear. Oh, we're about to find out. I have a sneaky suspicion. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. oh, you can't cry in Minecraft, but if, if I could, I would be crying. This was a terrible idea. This was a terrible idea. It's completely reliant on Turtle Master potions. I I don't have time right now to put everything back together the way it was. I do have some spare Oh, I have some spare tools. Okay. A I've I have a few spare tools. 
and I have some spare elytra. I've got one lonely nether netherite ingot. It's okay. I've I've got enough lint in my pocket to be able to put put my life back together. Now, I I don't have time for anything else in this episode now. It's been slightly spoiled by my shoddy red this redstone has killed me. My redstone has not only killed me, it's 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 taken everything from me. You know what? I think I think the the end of this episode I'm just going to listen to some music and think about what I've done.